staying in rhythm with his talented group of wide receivers. Damian Harris, speedy back, who's off to a great start. Number 34. As he's for this first play. He's got it. And now he creates a crease. And off the running is Damian Harris out of the secondary. Foot race. Harris to the house in the first play. His second 75-yard touchdown run of the season. An explosive start to an already festive evening here in Tuscaloosa. Wow, they have a very, very deep group of running backs. And as much as people want to talk about Bo Scarborough and Najee Harris and, and others, it's been Damian Harris all year long for the Crimson Tide. And boy, does he set the tone after last week's close call against a &M. First play of the game. Averaging eight and a half yards per carry coming in. It'll go up after that carry. His eighth touchdown of the season already. I talked about how they want to try to run the ball to the outside. And when you try to run the ball to the outside, see this inside technique, they want to try to get the ball out here. But watch this. Arkansas takes that away. And when you do, there's the vision and the cutback right there and the acceleration that he has for his size. 5'11", 220 pounds. Kind of an all-around talented back that they have. Not the most physical, but has that ability to have great vision, great balance, and that is impressive. And you can pull away from secondary players and take it all the way to the house for a touchdown. That's a great job. Damian Harris dropping some weight. He's changed his diet. He's become more explosive. He's become a breakaway runner, which he didn't used to be. Three huge runs already in the season. <laughs> Pretty easy for Jalen Hurts.